this commentary is about dumbass, how to become one. I'm the angry guy and I'll tell you how to do it. Welcome to Angry Guy's Commentary, where truth and facts are spoken. Our subject today is dumbass, how to become one. There are two classes of dumbasses. One is called a regular dumbass, and the highest honor is classified as extreme dumbass. For both, you have to forget you have any common sense. Throw it out, throw it out the window, man. Second, you have no fortitude to think on your own. So you become a sheep. And most important, you have to reassure yourself you're healthy. And this is your life. And no one's going to tell you how to live it. Being a regular dumbass means you think you're invincible. You might have diabetes, have a heart condition, or just recently had a stroke, or any underlying health condition. You go amongst people during a pandemic, stay within six feet of each other, while both of the parties are not wearing masks. That's how you become a regular dumbass. Today, June 19, 2020, which I am so glad our President of the United States stated he has made that particular date famous. Wow, that's today's date. What a guy, huh? Now, to be the extreme dumbass, you realize the number of cases and hospital visits concerning the coronavirus are increasingly, drastically, at this moment, today, June 19, 2020. Having that thought in mind, you must drop all common sense, stop thinking for yourself, and inherit the mob mentality. Knowing you are feeling good about yourself and having an underlying disease helps the coronavirus stay in your body, you still go to an indoor rally where there will be thousands of people not wearing masks. But you don't have to worry. Don't worry about it, about catching the coronavirus because the person who cares so much for you is having you sign a waiver. So in truth, in fact, if you do catch the coronavirus at this large indoor meeting of thousands where one person has invited you in the middle of a pandemic, you can't sue him. That's nice for him, isn't it? At least he's looking after himself and not you. All comments are welcome. Thank you.